it's been a month since we've done a walkthrough. Um, I've stopped doing them every fortnight because we've started all our table tennis and dancing programs and we're not having as much time here. But we're still here every night we get. Um, so I'll show you what we're up to. Nothing much has happened from the outside. But you'll step into a world of colour. Um, we have a now a beautiful blue entranceway. The ceilings and cornices have all been done. And if we proceed round into the lounge, we've got some nice sconce lights there. The lounge is um, completely finished as far as all the painting goes. And um, it's getting the floors. They've got the floor guy's been here this week and he'll be probably sanding in the next few days and then sealing it. So that'll really make a big difference to the house. So there's lots of putty going on. Uh, the kitchen has had a dramatic change since we last saw it. We emptied all the junk and um, ripped out all the old cupboards. Uh, I've had to repatch the floor underneath where the kitchen was. They'd used old chipboard up there. I don't know why the floorboards didn't go to full length. But... So I've patched it with some better flooring. There were some plumbing issues under there. The main drain was solidly blocked and probably for the last few years it's just been flooding under the house. So we fixed all that up, um, got some new points there for the, the new kitchen sink, had some extra wiring done and I just have to finish this flooring off tonight and then the uh, floor sander guy can seal this all up. So um, it's coming along nicely. Still got a few bit of cleaning to do in here. But uh, we'll get that done and then the plaster will come in and finish this off next week. Uh, so the back room, actually the laundry has now become kind of the workstation. And the back room uh, even more so because we have to work somewhere. Um, and here's my new um, table saw picked up from Aldi, only 150 bucks. It's pretty good value I thought and it's proving quite handy. Okay, while I'm out this way, we'll just duck down the back. Uh, the backyard's just um, a place to put stuff out of the house, but, um, you know, renovations involve stuff going everywhere. Um, the only thing we've done in the yard is I've now got the first of our garden infrastructure. Yes, I might just zoom in to save us walking. Is a, uh, a compost bin made out of pellets, so... I guess you can technically say we've started our garden. Alright, the roof's still looking good. We haven't had any leaks as you'd expect. So back inside. Back into the paint fumes. So yes, the hall is all blue. There's our painter extraordinaire up the ladder. <laughs> the, uh, the utility cabinet has an automatic light in it, so every time you walk past you get instantly blinded, but I'm sure that'll be better when there's a door on there. So the hall down here is nice and blue, the ceiling's nice and white. Uh, the yellow bedroom, I think you saw in the last video. But again, all these floors have been, we started sanding in there to get rid of the stains. Um, all little putty, putty the nails. Uh, the toilet's been taken out, so that we can finish off in there and get the floor organized. And the bathroom sort of regressed a bit because we've had to get some more plumbing. Well, we got the plumbing tidied up and I haven't actually got back to put the vanity in. We've sort of moved into the kitchen because these floors will be just vinyl. So they weren't critical to get clean, clean like the rest of the house for the sander. So this end bedroom, um, I was sealing in here last night, just plugging up gaps. Um, so this one's pretty much ready to paint. And um, the master bedroom, much the same. We're just tidying up all the little gaps and plugging holes and uh, getting ready to paint. But uh, next, uh, next walkthrough, you'll see our new floors. And um, really, we're not actually far from getting furniture in. So until next time, bye for now.